I'm interior designer Lisa Laporta and today I'm going to share with you some of my best tips for how to accessorize your home with the elements that I like to call house jewelry. Jewelry in a home can be any of the elements that are architectural or just decorative that add interest and drama, texture, color to a space. Metal elements are one of the most obvious forms of house jewelry, and they can work their ways into your home in many ways. Chandeliers, light fixtures, doorknobs, hinges. Mixing metals is a really current thing to do. You don't have to be strict about using only one finish. You could have a little brass, some antique copper, a little bit of nickel. It all works together, but my tip is bring them home and look at them in the space. It's hard to imagine what they're gonna look like when you're in the store. When it comes to jewelry, adding the unexpected is a good thing. Have a look at this granite countertop. There's quartz, there are elements in it that sparkle and glisten, and especially when it's lit, it's a beautiful piece. Light fixtures themselves can be jewelry, or the light they give can accent or highlight details that you really want to draw attention to. Before, there were two simple little fixtures here that were almost like stud earrings. Now you have two fixtures that are oversized, dramatic. They anchor the island and they anchor the great room. When it comes to jewelry, think of size and scale and play with it. And it's okay to go oversized. When you're talking about curb appeal in the front of your house, go a little larger. It's a really great way to show off architecture. Color is every bit an accessory in like jewelry to a room. Look at this ruby red sofa. Having reoccurring pops of this same color is a really great way to unify and create balance in the space. You can do the same thing with pattern. When it comes to selecting the right jewelry for your space, think of it as simply as changing a pair of earrings with an outfit. Light fixtures are a really inexpensive way to transform a space and use jewelry to create a look. This is a pretty cool fixture. Doesn't get any more like jewelry than this. Sometimes even just a little change of lampshade can do wonders for a room. When it comes to master bathrooms and powder rooms, you can never have too much jewelry. Think of it like a statement necklace that you might wear with a black dress. Look at this shower floor. It is a mosaic of different types of onyx and granite and marble, and it looks like a real koi fish pond. This probably cost as much as a diamond necklace, and the person who lives in this house should love it as much. Remember, jewelry is no less important to a room as a watch or a necklace is to a great outfit.